guys is the switch for the winch basically when you press up it will connect blue with black red with the green when you connect down it will connect red green blue and this two wire which I don't need this is for left and right I don't need them so basically this two serenite or relay what you call it it will do the same job the remote have so many wires of course this one all this wire for south east west which I don't need what I need is up and down and this is the main source for it so this is the main source for the uh, remote control so basically when you press up this solenoid will work and it will connect red green black with blue and when you press down this serenite will work and it will connect blue red green so we have to make a box for it and we have to connect it with the winch and also this one so this will be here of course and it will go to the winch so you can use the remote and we can use the manual Okay guys, here is the unit, you can see we have black, red, blue and green, okay, for up position you have to connect red with the green, black with the blue, for down you have to connect blue, red, green. And these which come from the remote one is for up one is for down line neutral so for cable from the remote one up down line and neutral and you can see this is the four wire which go to the relays it's coming here So what I did, this is the original switch for the winch. I cut the wire here, you can see. So there is four wire here. It's uh, red, black, blue, and green. Of course, I don't have the, all the color. That's why I mix up with the color. So don't worry. It should be green, blue, black, and red. When I press so, up, it will operate the up relay and it will connect red green blue black when you press down it will operate the down relay and again it will connect blue red green so this remote it's only controlling the relay one and two so here you can see this is the main cable four wire and four wire same orders going to the relay box i will open this and i will show you and one is going for the winch and the other is going all the way down all the way down to the other switch that I fixed down so I have two switch one is down one is up and I have this remote system okay now this is the down switch I connect parallel to the up which I show you earlier and it's working very fine
guess it's a long, long cable all the way up. It's four wire cable. You can see. As you can see, this remote has a lot of features. See, north, west, east, south, all this we don't need. What we need is up and down, and stop, start. So stop, start, up and down, and all the other thing we don't need. So if you come here, this is the cable for the, which is coming all the way from the remote. You can see there is a diagram here also. It's very easy to fix it's going all the way so what I did this is for east and west which I, which I don't need so I just cover it what I take the main and up and down so you can see the yellow is up and the blue is down so basically when you press up it will operate the up solenoid and when you press down, it will operate the down solenoid. So when you press up, it will operate this one, and which connect red, the green, black, and blue. When you press down, it will operate this uh, uh, relay, and it will connect blue, red, and green. This is the wire cable which is going to the switch to the winch and these which come from the remote we have the main power we have the neutral we have uh, yellow and we have the blue so yellow is uh, up blue is down okay guys so here's how the remotes work if you press down and up it will not go first you have to press start then down like i say it's operating only the relays and the relay is doing all the job. When you finish, you just press stop. Now nobody can see. Okay, now the remotes, like I said, it's controlling only the relays. So if I stop the winch, I disconnect the winch and I press E. Down, up, down, up. So it is two unit now. The winch is separate, and the remote control unit is separate. So in any in case of any failure of this, you just close the remote control, disconnect it, and you can operate the winch normally without the remote. Okay, so I fix a stop switch here and it's very easy I just cut the black wire which is going to the winch and I connect one end to the switch and go back to the black wire again so now when the tray come up it will disconnect but it will go down I try to fix one of those down but uh, for some reason, I couldn't, it will not work if you fix it down. It will work only for up. You fix it up because uh, the black wire, if you cut it, it will not go up, but it will go down. But any other wire you cut, it will stop down, but it will not come up again. So if anybody knows how to fix a switch like this down, please leave a comment down below. So. Now again, it will come out, it will stop, even with the manual you cannot come, it will, not come. It will go down, but these relays are very cheap, you can find it everywhere, you can find it in any 
store air condition store which they sell a part for air condition i think this relays fix in the outdoor unit for the air condition and they are very cheap you know in our country it's uh, 2 bd i don't know exactly how much in dollar but it's very cheap i'm not uh, expert in electrician but i know some things uh, i bring some experts some ex electrician people they try to fix the remote directly with the winch but for some reason reason they couldn't so i come out with this plan the relay now it's almost two months and uh, it's working fine i don't see i don't see any issue with it everything is working fine i hope i help somebody out there like i said i'm not uh, expert in electrician but i have some experience and i'm sure there is a lot of expert people there they can explain better than me but this is what i come up and it's working fine now it's been uh, two months i have no issue with it everything is working fine i just need to cover all this and i have a cover for the books and everything thanks for fine. watching and please uh, subscribe and share and all that stuff below and see you on the next one